Hello, Pokemon fans. I'm Professor K. And I'm Matt. And welcome to another Mega Mailbox Mania Monday, where we show off the mail we've got. This time, it's over the last two weeks, because we really haven't gotten much lately. So that's why there was no Mega Mailbox posted last Monday. But today, we've got a few different things here to show for you guys. So thank you to everyone who submitted. First and foremost, if you'd like to submit to the series, our P.O. Box is in the description down below. It is P.O. Box 15194, Brooksville, Florida 34604, if you're too lazy to check or whatever the case is. But yeah, there it is. <laughs> All right, let's get started here with an FCBM from Jack first. There is a note right here on top. Return address, do not show on camera. If you're going to, uh, honestly, if you're going to show a return address, this is the best way to do it right here, because that means we can't, it's idiot proof. We can't show it by accident. So nice job on that one, Jack. With a Helioptile and an Esper in here. And I think yeah. there's actually something behind the Esper. Oh, look, it's a Halucha. Oh. Is there anything behind the Helioptile? Oh, there is. Ew, it's a monkey. <laughs> what? How come I got two terrible things in mind? All right, so here's the note. Dear Professor K and... <laughs> this is my first time ever sending anything to you guys. My name is Jack and I'm 12 years old. I have my own YouTube channel called The Mythical Gengar. If you could, could you please put the link to the channel in the bio? Uh, I hope you like everything I sent. And sorry that I didn't send more. If I I don't have that many things to send, sorry. If you don't mind, could N sign the Esper and Halucha? And K, could you sign the Panport and Helioptile? And could you please send these cards back to me with the address in one of the sleeves of the cards to sign in? Have a nice day. Sincerely, Jack or The Mythical Gengar. Guys, please check out my Instagram called The Mythical Gengar. It is one with all words, with one word and no caps. Sure. Yeah, we can definitely sign these and send them back. I'll try to find your channel, but um, since you didn't provide a link, it might actually be really hard to do so. So if it's not in the description down below, I apologize. But uh, unfortunately, YouTube makes things hard to find, especially for channels that are smaller. So I'll do my best. All right. So that's for you. Random pack number one, two, and then this. So I'll start with this one. No pack trick needed. Ooh, all right. So we got a Jungle Eevee, a Togunamaru, a Base Set 2 Doe Duo, Pancham, Dark Energy, Vaporeon, Trainer's Mail, Linoon, Ultra Ball, Reverse Hollow Roselia, and a Gengar Hollow. I guess it's only fitting since your channel is the mythical Gengar after all. Awesome. Thank Very. you. And random pack number two. If it wants to cooperate with me. We have a Minchino, Togunamaru, Garboach, Shelter, Sock, Water Energy, Curlia, Gotharita, Pokemon Fan Club, and Lily. A Reverse Hollow Mantine, and a Snorlax GX promo card. Sun and Moon number five. Awesome. That was one of the very first GX cards we saw. I believe it was the very first GX card we saw. Which if I'm one? not mistaken. Uh, Snorlax GX, it was revealed to us, I think, before any of the other ones were. Yeah. Yeah, that one was legal before and before even because um, that came up before Sun and Moon Base. It did. It did. I remember because Xerneas and that Xerneas breaking that was actually a deck. Yeah, it was. Jerkro, Helioptile. Oh great, monkeys for days. Yay! Jerkro, Helioptile, and a Black Kiram EX from Legendary Treasures. Well, thank you for that card anyway. <laughs> 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 All right, and you've got yours here, which is a no pack trick needed for yourself. Oh, uh, man, if you got trolled this hard. Then again, he addressed me as Professor, so maybe he likes me more. I don't know. All right, hey, we got a Zorba. Six points, six points. Nippy! No! Okay, you're fine. No! No! Ugh! And a Chandelure EX from Legendary Treasures. I have complaints about... Hold on, let me take you up. I have complaints about these four! Just not Slowking. Yeah, Slowking I have no problem with. <laughs> no problem with what's over, but joke aside, thank you very much. Appreciate that. Alright, next up here is going to be your FCBM from Ryan. Oh, there's something in there for you. All right, it's empty. For normal, then. <laughs> it's not cool. <laughs> hey! <laughs> <laughs> He's only telling the truth. <laughs> what is this? 
For normal and not a. Because mm. you're not. But I'm and I'm anything I wanna be. I wanna be something. I am that. All right, so we got a Pashimian, an Oracorio, six points. Eh. I like these three though, but eh. <laughs> uh, you're mean. All right. And the other two there are for you. For Professor K. What's this say? Hey, Professor K and Normal N. It's Ryan again. Professor K, I was just wondering if you have a Pikachu X or Greninja EX. If you do, say it in the vid, and in the next letter, I will tell you what I'm willing to trade. They will all be real. I hope you like the cards. Professor K, you are my favorite. N is not a professor. Keep the videos going. Bye. <laughs> I actually do not have any extra Pikachu EX or Greninja, EG, or Greninja EX either. Um, I haven't had extras of those for quite some time, actually, so sorry about that, buddy. But let's see what's in this pack. And actually, to be completely honest, I, um, I've kind of stopped doing trading in general just because uh, we don't play as much anymore. And as a collector, I already have pretty much everything I'm looking for except for really, really, really old, ultra-rare stuff. So that's the only reason why. Unless a new set comes out and we don't pull stuff. That's when we're looking for trades. All right, so we have a Beware Reverse, a Honchcrow Reverse. <laughs> There's the Helioptile, which is ripped, and a Zoomeril Reverse Hollow as well. Why did you rip Helioptile? He's a nice guy. Look, it came pre-ripped. He said I could rip it again because it's taped. So I get to rip it even though it's already ripped. He's a nice guy. He didn't hurt anybody. Sure. All right. Thank you very much for that. And next up here we have SDBM from Hugo all the way from Spain. So this is going to be interesting. Lots of cool stuff from overseas. Oh my goodness, there's a lot of stuff in here. All right. So let's get this out of the way so I don't show anything I shouldn't be showing. We have some... Sunflower seeds? Are these sunflower seeds? They kind of look like sunflower seeds. Uh, yeah. But I don't know what... There's something special about them, obviously, because there's... They don't look like... Hmm. I'm not sure. That's a tough one. That is a tough one, especially because... Yeah. Um, I don't know other languages. Huh. Same. Okay. Not to mention, Spanish in Spain is far different than Spanish in other cultures. So. Throw that over there. Um... The annoying letter of the box. Okay. Do not show on camera address. All right. That will not be shown. Uh, memes. All right. Professor N opens. Ha! Shut up. <laughs> I guess I'll let you do that. At least some people understand oh, that's the cool. truth. That is cool. All right. I guess I'll read this first. What's this say here? Evolutions is the best set ever. I don't care what you say. <laughs> Hey, everyone has their favorites, right? Okay, so this is the actual letter. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this. Why don't you like it? I don't like this letter. Read it. I don't want to read it. Read it, you have to. <laughs> Dear Professor N and Companion. <laughs> Listen, first and foremost, I am his stepdad. Number one. <laughs> Number two, I'm a professor and he is not. <sighs> I think, therefore I am. I sent you stuff, hope you like it. Stuff I wanted to tell you. I'm from Spain, and me and my brothers love to watch your channel, and blah blah blah. <laughs> I feel the sincerity in this letter. <laughs> I only want Professor N to open these. Oh, well, shoot. Well then! Uh, that's kind of unfortunate, because he has something else to open. So I guess you're doing most of the opening here today. I actually wanted to trade this for some English boosters and... Something there, I'm not sure. Uh, I don't have any actual sealed packs, though. Uh, I meant all of this to be opened with... Can't read that word. You have to give away all the codes in the video. Don't squeeze the squishies, they are old. Okay? Uh, these... They don't tell you how to live your life! I can't tell what that says. These Pokemon something, or however they are called, are from year 2000, and you can't find them on eBay. Sealed, uh, open... Goes for about 20 bucks each. Obviously, as in from as I'm from Spain, the packs are in Spanish, so you won't understand Halucha. Okay. I wish I had found more monkeys. <laughs> this was so hard to make for you guys. Uh, 
I hope you appreciate it. Oh, I absolutely. wanted to tell my Pokemon channel, but that might be... Spam? So if you want to tell the people to subscribe, the name in that not open address... Okay, the name of that channel is in there. Wow. Okay, I'm sorry I'm having a little bit of trouble reading your cursive there, but uh, I think I got the general idea of the letter. I guess I can't open any of this stuff, but I'll still find your channel in this letter here, then, and I'll let you know. Uh, oh, shoot, I can't tell what that says. Mr... I can't tell what that says. Mis Mr. Galleon Pokemon? G-A-L-I-O-N? Or E-O-N? Uh, yeah, it's either Mr. Galleon Pokemon or Mr. Golden Pokemon. Mr. Golden Pokemon? I'm not sure. I can't really tell off the cursive, I'm sorry. Yeah. But I do have the, uh, the rest of it here is, of course, an address, so I don't want to show that. All right, well, I guess I'll let you open the packs, but I do want to mention here that these are things that they were, he was talking about there. These are the squeezies. Obviously, I don't want to do that. It looks like Snorlax is already cracking there across the neck, so we definitely don't want to mess that up. But this is really cool. I want to squeeze it, though. Don't squeeze it. You'll break it. Grip it, squeeze. As he said, this is actually from 2000, so this is really old. The Snorlax and a poly whirl which also squeeze them though but look at it though they're already cracking you don't want to mess them up any further squeeze them, though. no not gonna do that so thank you very much for sending these i've never actually seen these before and obviously in the year 2000 i was 12 so i mean i would have remembered seeing these i would think i was six you wouldn't have remembered <laughs> but yeah this is really cool so thank you so much for these um, the code cards are all to be given away. Even though they say Spanish languages down there at the bottom, they actually convert to whatever English you use or whatever language you're using in Pokemon Trading Card Game Online. Really? Yeah, no matter what, they're universal. They switch to whatever language that you're using that, your, your that's game. That's actually in. pretty cool. Yeah. So, um, I will let you go over then, like I said, the rest of this stuff, which I'll leave in a little pile there. And yeah, go for it. All right. And he said we need to give away all these, right? Yes, all the code cards that you get in the Alright, so let's go ahead and do that first for you guys here. Soli Luna. Or Sun and Moon. Yep. Legianas Luminosas. Legianas Lim Luminosas. Feel. Wow. There's another Sun and Moon. Okay. They're all like different upside down stuff. Like, let's just let's just get everything here. Oh, right here. That's another Sun and Moon. Soli Luna. Soli Luna. That's a Raichu and. Cheats the Entredo Soli Luna. Like, I can't. Sombras Aridantes. Soras Aridantes. Sombras Aridantes. Soras Aridantes. Uh, Spanish is hard. Why is Spanish so hard? And I think I'm actually half Spanish. <laughs> All right, Professor N open. I don't mind if I do. All right, so we have, just look at things. Okay, we'll just look at them. We have a Spanish list thing. We have a Spanish Pampor, Machop, nothing. <laughs> Vanillish, wow, they all keep the same names in Spanish. It's pretty interesting. Cubone with Mufasa there. Helioisk, a Pikachu, and a Pansy. Wow, even though these are Spanish cards, they all keep the English names that we know. So this is an empty pack here of evolutions. We have a custom made three pack of burning shit, not burning shadows, Um, Crimson Invasion. And in Spanish, so we have Graveler de Alola, Orangaroo, and Corpse Fish. I can't do the growly voice Professor K does. Actually, my throat is hurting me today, so I don't recommend myself doing it either. Yep. Legend of Luminal Sus Shining Legends. Alright, so we got ourselves a Purloin here, a Croconaw, Pikachu, Ekans, Zora, Reverse Gola. Oh, wow, this was an actual pack. It just happened to get open slightly. Oh, wow. I thought that was a custom one. Givoltal, the Fighting Energy, Spiritomb. Super, okay, so that's Super Scoop Up. We have the um, Pokemon Catcher. And here is a code card for it. There you guys go. 
So, uh, is this... Can this actually be a real... Spanish Guardians Rising pack, then? Alright. So we got ourselves a Nose Pass, Taylor, Rock Ruff, Demi, No, Energy Lotto, Teenage Lucas. We got ourselves Brooklet Hill, Reverse Hollow Rare Victory Belt, and a Minior Hollow. Very nice, very nice. I like that they all keep the same names. Alright, so we have another Spanish Guardians Rising. Okay, this one's custom. Alright, so we have a Jack with Chalice here. Olamoma. A Chikorita little card from Pokemon Go. We have an Angry Bird Uno card. We have Octel from Invasimals. I have no idea what that. I've never heard of that before. Must be something in Spain. Dark Rattle Raptor. We have a custom made Paper Dragon Energy. I like that. We have Zcom, Envel Pinel. So it's a Star Wars kind of thing. I think it was, I think this was from like Lunchables. I think, and we have we have here a soccer player. So looking cool, looking cool. All right, I believe I I believe I did for that, and I yeah, actually the next one. yep. Well, I should say the next two because these are both from the same person. Gonna be both from Will. Oh, wow. Wow, there's a lot here. All right, so there's codes, old cards, a Dragon Ball Super Pack, wow. Okay, and this, that's for us to sign. Uh, hold on. Is this the... I think this is a return envelope with stamps. I don't want to rip it. So the I, I believe it is. Yeah, I see a stamp on there. Yeah, Pokemon booster pack. There's a note. K's drawings and K's booster pack. Yep. Do you want to go ahead and open up your pack first? Because I'm opening them both things. Just makes more sense. Sure. You can do that. Then right. after, he, after he opens that, I'll go ahead and read the note. Oh, actually, I have two different packs here. I've got a Pokemon and a Dragon Ball Super. Oh, I also I have, a Dragon Ball Super I have my own drawing on here, too. So I'll just do all of my stuff to get it out of the way. So these are you, 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 all you. Oh, yeah, and there's also... That's well, not an address, so... Apparently, this is in here, too, which I did see because I was looking for notes. But yeah, there's a Tapu Lele GX in here. I don't know why just yet, but I guess we're going to find out in the letter. So... That's a thing! What? Exactly. <laughs> That's what eh? I said. Alright, so Kay's drawing first and foremost is... Wow, really? Sparkle Army? I figured that'd be for you. Is it Dancy? Are you sure that was yours? It says Kay's drawing. Kay's drawing right I mean, there. Dancy looks good, but... Yeah, it is. I'm just surprised, because Sparkle Army is more of N's thing. Huh. Well, that's a good drawing. Thank you, man. Um... Put that back there. Like I said, we'll figure out what's up with the Tapu Lele, I guess, when we get to the notes. So, Kay's Pokemon Booster Pack. Wonder if there's a pack trick. I guess we'll find out. We got a Double Blade. Oh, that's an upside down card. Flabebe, Dupider, Bergmite. Another upside down card. Chansey, Houndoom, Gumi, Fossil Excavation Map, and a fairy energy, which means I think had we done the pack trick, which is one, two, three, three and two. If you do a three-two pack trick, it actually puts the rare in the reverse in the back. So your pack's gonna have a three-two pack trick. All right, cool. And my Dragon Ball Super Pack. Oh, oh, okay, cool. This is from the starter deck. Super Saiyan three Son Goku maximum energy from the very first starter deck. Mighty Striker Son Gohan from set one. Courageous Heart Yajirobe from set two. Father Son Gallic Gun, set two. Taunting Piccolo, set one. And Infinite Force Fused Zamasu, a super from Union Force, set two. Awesome. Thank you very much. Very, very cool. All right. So now the rest of it's up to you. There's the notes, your booster packs, and then all this good stuff. All right. Hopefully go it ahead. says something about the Lele in there. It's, I'm, I'm thinking it should. I mean, a Lele is kind of a big deal. Yeah. No 
A lot of tape there, just didn't want to rip the note. Dear Professor K, yeah, I don't think you guys will be able to read this too well because it's in pencil, but Dear Professor K and N, my name is Will, and this is the second time I have sent you fan mail. Can N sign the Zora and the Esper, and can Professor K sign the Fletchender? And the Meowth, I have sent some homemade packs for you going to op guys to open. I have also sent you a huge stack of old cards and some drawings. Oh yeah, there is also some codes and figures. There is a tiny yellow bubble mailer. Inside is a gem mint 10 Tapu Lele GX. And I was wondering if you would trade it for a random PSA graded card. Hmm. Okay. P.S. There is an envelope with my address on it. Will. Um... Just as a note, see guys, I think I've said this before, when it comes to trades, please, 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 please contact me in my email before anything else, because if you just send it, then it costs us to send it back to you, uh, and I don't really think that that's you know, necessarily fair, so yeah. please, if you're going to send something, make sure you say something in an email first, and don't send it until we've already confirmed that it's trades actually possible, because I don't know if I have anything PSA that I can send off to you like that, so... We'll see. If not, I'll have to send back the Lele. Yeah. Yeah. All right, let's go ahead and... Oh yeah, so what'd you pull for your Dragon Ball packs? What? You said you had a custom Dragon Ball Super Pack too, right? Yeah. I, you were standing like right there, I thought. No. I was not. Oh, okay. I'm just curious what you got. Over there, you can check it out later. <laughs> oh, it's over there. Oh, okay. Thought you might have had it here. All right, so I got myself a not two Squirtle, Snover, Grass Energy, Onyx, Eevee, Pokemon Ranger, Reverse Hollow Grandpa, and a dark and a shiny Dark Ride GX. This should have been a promo. Why is this an alternate print? Sad face. Why, Pokemon? Why do you do the stupid things of making alternate prints a thing? Don't do the stupid things, Pokemon. Go back to promos. All right, so we got Vegeta, the Proud Father, God Rush, Goku, Pilaf, Videl, Piccolo, and Vegeta, the Proud Father again. I got a super, and you didn't. <laughs> yeah. Once again, just having to work around the tape. Oh wow, mine was a uh, Ask Greninja saying Greninja rocks. I think that that got reversed. <laughs> yeah, I I'm sorry, I think this was, I mean, it looks good. Both drawings good. look good, I'm saying they might have been reversed. I think they might have been meant, yeah. They I mean, I like Greninja and all, but that's really more your thing. Yes. All right, we have codes here. Did you ever say to give these away? No. Nope. All right, then we'll be using them for PDCGO. Thank you very much for that. And here we have Old cards, a huge stack of them. Oh wow, these are old. Ooh. Well, it should be interesting. Stuff that would be far. A lot of Sabrina stuff. Here. Whoa! That hurt. I hit my knee on the table. Hey, it's not broken, is it? No. That was loud. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I just when I heard old cards, I had to see. Yeah, this is definitely more your area of expertise than mine. Yeah, a lot of energy base set stuff. Of course, there's some Jim Era stuff there on the top, as you mentioned. Some yep. Team Rocket stuff. Uh, that is Jim's, Jim Series, Neo Era. Oh, that's uh, E Series Era. Yep. More Neo. Base set, mostly all that's base set. Very cool. Very. Awesome. All right. And now we have another thing here sent to us by Will. That's your area of expertise. Oh, oh, yeah, definitely. There are Yu-Gi-Oh cards here. And go ahead, just put those in a pile. Oh, wow. There is no note on this one. And the previous note said nothing about this either. So I guess I don't really have much to say. I didn't just go through the cards. Yeah, just go through them. Yeah. Because like I said, the previous note said nothing on these, and there was no note that came with this. 
Some pretty cool stuff in here, like a clear Supreme King clear ring, an ultimate rare, bottomless. Oh wow, we even got some secret rares in here. An ultras, wow, whoa. I've actually been needing some of this stuff to build some new decks. So dang, man, Apprentice Illusion? What? Neo Galaxy. Galaxy actually getting a lot of support, so that's cool to have. Another Dark Rebellion. Swords, Odd Eyes. Man! See, this, this is what I really needed, too, because I really want to rebuild the Odd Eyes deck. And that was one of the things I needed. Fright for Reborn. Cypher Dragon. Dang! Dark Magician. Man, just good stuff overall. Especially stuff I needed. And these, I believe, are... these. At least some of these appear to be much older Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Some of them look fairly decent, fairly newish. Okay, yeah, see, this stuff is newish. That's definitely newer. Oh, wow, an overload. Odd Eyes Advent. Yeah, a lot of Cyber Angel stuff here. We got Nova to go with that Infinity we got. Dang! Man, just, just a lot of stuff here. A lot of the older stuff, I even saw uh, Proto Cyber Dragon. Man, that's, that's just supposed to be getting a ton of support coming, I believe, in August is when Cyber Dragon Horizon comes out. And Cyber Dragons are going to be getting crazy support. But yeah, just a huge stack of Yu Gi Oh cards. I actually needed these two Spiral Flame Strikes. Wow, just thank you. Wish that, I wish I could say more on these, like if there was like an, a note to go with these or something, but no, there isn't. And even these sleeves. Like these are like pretty good sleeves, which is good because my Yu Gi Oh sleeves are kind of eh at the moment, so anything helps. Thank you. Thank you very much, Will. Appreciate that greatly. And was there anything else? Yeah, there's one more box. All right. Need me to move anything? That looks kind of big. Yeah, it's pretty big. So we just have to kind of just push some stuff off to the side here a little bit. That should be enough. Okay, so this next box here is an FABM. <laughs> We're making stuff up now, guys. This is free art by mail. So there's actually pictures in this box. Um, let me get this so that the address is not shown. Take this off camera and pull some of the stuff out. Some of it is for you, some of it is for me. There's two here for N. Oh, no, three here for N. And it looks like there's three for me as well. Empty box goes over there. That was scary. Sorry. All right, so I'll go over mine first, and then I'll let you go over your three. Okay, so K1. Let's see what we have here. Oh wow, these are actual paintings. These are not, uh... oh, that is so cool. Look at that. Yo, Greninja with, with shurikens. What? This is, a, oh, by the way, free upper mail by Giggle Gal, by the way. I forgot to write name on this. This is Giggle Gal who sent these in. That is super cool, as you can see, GG. Very, very nice. Let's see what's in the next one. I thought they were just going to be drawings, but this is actual paintings. Let's see. Um, all right, let me just take this off here so I can finish ripping the bubble wrap off of them. <laughs> Why? <laughs> yes. Helioptile in sniper mode. I love this. I love this. This is great. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> That's exactly perfect. Oh, my goodness. Oh, sorry about that, guys. Bump the camera. It's hard to open this stuff up in front of the, uh, the camera with as little room as we have. So let's bring that back up. All right, so the last one I have here before you get into yours is, oh shoot, 
I have a feeling this is this is one of two because I see another lightsaber here that's red. I'm gonna guess that you probably have a Zorark in here that this is supposed to go with, where they end up fighting each other. That would be amazing. I see it coming from a mile away right now. This is really cool. All right, so I'm gonna actually set this one back here so you can uh, you can actually show that when it happens. Um, I don't want to lean that. There we go. That'll work. Okay, so your three pictures are are next. All right. Pink bubble wrap. And oh, it's gonna be a little Zora with a little baby Zora. That's cute. I like this one. It's funny because blue is my favorite color. You got the blue one. Of course, black wouldn't work out very well with Zora, I guess. Nah. Besides, real men are all about pink. You got pink bubble wrap. <laughs> yes! Perfect. Yes! This one's just all sorts of levels of yes! <laughs> and here's the final one for me. Now, is it gonna come true? Pretty sure it is because I saw a Pika lightsaber. And this is gonna be amazing. Yep! Called it. I called it. There you go. It's sheer beauty. That is really cool. It is. I like that a lot. I looked through some of those codes. Go ahead and give this one away while we're here. Okay. Ooh, a forbidden, a pre-release box. Yep. I know we won't make any use out of that, so. You lucky dogs. All right, there you go. All right, guys. Well, that is going to do it for today. Giggle Gal, thank you so much for these paintings. These are really awesome. Very much. Yeah, this is this is really cool. Thank you so much for sending those. And thank you to everybody else who submitted to Mega Mailbox Mania Monday as well. We always appreciate it, guys. Um, yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to hit that like button. Comment down below. Subscribe for more TCG content. And we will see you guys in the next video. So until then, you all take care and have a great day. Bye-bye.